What is going on guys, Sinister here, back with another Madden video. We're taking a look at the rosters for the NFC East, starting with the Cowboys. We got Dak coming in with the 86 overall. Ezekiel Elliott, that six game suspension, but he's got the 90 overall. Darren McFadden and Alvin Morris are going to have to pick up a lot of slack there, but I think they can do it behind this crazy offensive line that they still possess. Des Bryant, and Cole Beasley, and Terrence Williams are leading the way for them. Lucky Whitehead no longer on the team. Jason Witten's still on the team, though. Tyron Smith, Jonathan Cooper is going to be the, the uh, I don't want to say the missing link, but the X factor there. Uh, wasn't high on him at Cleveland, so I don't know. Maybe Dallas can teach him something. Travis Fedrick, Zach Martin, and Lyle Collins are going to have to step it up now. But I think he will. I, I don't think they're really going to have that much of a problem. The defensive line and defense overall is okay. Jalen Smith. Coming out, Sean Lee, great middle linebacker too. Another one, I, I wouldn't say he's underrated because Sean Lee gets a lot of respect, but really great player that, uh, in him. And that's secondary, aside from Byron Jones, is pretty woeful. Dan Bailey and Chris Jones. Next up would be probably the Eagles. Yes, the Eagles. Quarterbacks, Carson Wentz with a 79. I think he's going to have a breakout year. I'm not, I don't really like the Eagles at all, in all honesty, and I'm not a huge fan of Carson Wentz, but I think he can have a pretty decent year. Nick Foles is still on the team. What happened to him? Wasn't he supposed to be the next best thing, and then pfft, and the Brock Osweiler effect? LeGarrette Blunt and Darren Sproles, just two polar opposites. You got 5'6", 190, 6'2", 250. <laughs> Ryan Matthews there, so they got a three-headed monster on their running back core. And an offensive juggernaut, actually, because they also have Alshon Jeffrey, Jordan Matthews, Torrey Smith, Nelson Aguilar, who still needs to show up, Zach Ertz, Brent Selleck, I mean, good lord, Jason Peters, their offensive line is pretty damn decent, too, uh, I think improved, Lane Johnson is really freaking amazing, Chris Long is on this team, Brandon Graham, Fletcher Cox, Nigel, ba I mean, this team right now is looking nice this looks like the madden team secondary is not so much so secondary needs some work big time oh you got malcolm jenkins but other than that um for sure needs some work caleb sturgis is now their kicker next one with the cowboys or the eagles we got redskins giants so i guess giants next eli is gonna have an 88 when 80 wow okay so horrible rating for eli compared to what he's used to geno smith on the giants shane Barine still on this team wow he's their starting running back too okay i guess this team really is uh <laughs> odell beckham jr you have brandon marshall now on the team and sterling shepherd now so pretty good weapons there for eli actually really good weapons will tie as their tight end this offensive line is meh at best Jason Pierre-Paul is not meh he is really good <laughs> Olivier Vernon again really good this defense is is just really good um in general <laughs> so there really ain't much to say about that Landon Collins with a 92 overall and last but not least we got the Redskins let's see where my boy TP's at Got Kirk Cousins with an 85 overall and Colt McCoy down there. Robert Kelly is going to be their starting running back. Six foot two thirty-three. Big guy. Very big guy. We got Terrell Pryor Senior with an 83 overall. Jamison Crowder. I almost said Jay Crowder. Wrong sport. <laughs> and Brain uh, Brian Quick, sorry, not Brandon Quick. Josh Doxon. He was down there too, wasn't he? Yeah. TCU. Jordan Reed with an Oh, they got another tight Who's their other tight end? Vernon Davis. I forgot he went there as well. Trent Williams. And then nobody else, really. Oh, their offensive line isn't too bad. Jonathan Allen. Ziggy Hood is on this team. Ryan Kerrigan. Pretty good player. Fan of him. Josh Dorman. Indifferent on him. Uh, I like him and Odell playing, but I think Josh Dorman's a little overrated. I mean, he's great. Do not get me wrong, but little overrated Dustin Hopkins and Tress Sway and I think that is it for the East we did the Cowboys Giants Eagles and now Redskins yes so that is gonna wrap it up guys if you enjoyed it be sure to drop a like and hit subscribe if you already haven't and until next time I'll see you again soon